Zahara. Zahara, we need to start somewhere. How many this week? How many? Three. That is a lot to handle, especially in seven days. doing the absolute best that you can and you can only do so much in each thing that eases the pain My son, he's not breathing. He's not breathing. Okay, just to somebody now, please. Calm down. My son is dead. Josh, wake up. Josh, wake up, baby. Please wake up. Josh, wake up. Wake up for mommy. Josh, wake up. Wake up, baby, please. <laughs> <laughs> This isn't... This isn't something they could just train you for. I mean, they, they teach you all sorts of coping mechanisms and how to, how to deal with these types of situations, but at the end of the day, no one can, no one can prepare you for this type of scarring. Calm down, all right? I'll get you help, okay? Hello, yes, I need help. I think my brother trying to kill himself and he won't let me in the room. Jesse, just open the door, man. I don't know, I don't know. He just keeps sending me these text messages saying that he doesn't think he can live anymore. Yes, he, he does, he has a gun. Jesse! Look, I need someone to help me get him out of his room. Look, I can't calm down. That's my little brother, man. <laughs> Everything. I hear everything. I watch bullets go into skulls. I, I listen to blood splatter. I listen to last breaths. It's like 
living out a horror movie over and over again, except I'm choosing to. Please wake up, come on. Please, Grandpa, Grandpa, wake up. Grandpa. It's not just a job. This isn't just me getting up every day and going to work. I get up every day and I witness last moments. And I gotta sit there and tell them that everything's gonna be okay and it rarely ever is. remember every single one, every choke, every scream, every suicide, and every day I just collect more, more and more demons. Nine one one, what's your emergency? 